up YouTube I'm back with another video like share and subscribe to my channel um you see the title don't get sensitive about this black people don't get sensitive now I'm I'm you know I'm same color as you I'm talking about my own race now there ain't no no racism no nothing I'm, I'm talking about my own race and um you know there's a reason that this this Black Lives Matter and stuff is going on. Racism is going on so heavy right now in this world. So heavy. Because of the ignorance. Now, not all the time, though. But what I've been seeing lately is the ignorance. That black people be be doing, and for reasons why the officers and why people be acting this way towards us, you know. Now I might get up under some people's skin. You might get mad at me. Hey, so be it. But I'm speaking the truth. I'm speaking the truth. Black people, and you know, don't get don't if if you're sensitive, don't listen to the video. Don't watch the video. But you know, people marching, people marching for Black Lives Matter. I was I was just at work the other day, well, yesterday, and who was it, Reverend Al Sharpton or somebody? He, you know, they said we're going to march. We're going to meet in D.C. in front of the White House, in front of the Capitol. We're going to go march. We're going to go march in, for Black Lives Matter and stuff. So... My thing is, we're doing all this marching, all this marching and marching and marching and stuff for something. But do you, but do you see the pattern that's going on? Do y'all see, do y'all see the, the bigger picture of what's going on? Look at the bigger picture. This has nothing to do with racism. It, ha it has nothing to do with, with racism. Sometimes. But majority of the time, it, it has nothing to do with racism. Now, if you're going to come under my video with some negative comments, don't do it. Because you're not going to get a response. It's just going it's just uh, going to be an irrelevant comment. Just to make yourself seem good. Seem, seem, seem like you feeling good about leaving a negative comment. Hey, do it. I don't care. But, you know, it's, it's like it's sad because the bigger picture is the enemy is not... It's not the police and stuff. The enemy, they're not the enemy. The presidents and stuff, they're, they're not the enemy. Satan's the enemy. That's who's the enemy. Because God talked about it in the Bible about racism. If you're racist towards towards anybody, you know, you're going to have to, you're going to have to answer to that. You're going to get punished for that. It's a spirit. It's a demonic spirit. It has nothing to do with color, with color and, you know, the color of a police officer. Because you see black police officers doing the same thing to, to black people. A black police officer. So where does it have anything to do with, with the color of an officer's skin and stuff doing that? No, it's that demonic spirit. It's that demonic spirit. That's what's doing it. And a demonic spirit, you know, when they jump inside of a body, it, it's doing Satan's work. I know what I'm talking about, people. It has nothing to do with the color of an officer's skin. Because you're seeing black officers being the same way. You're seeing that too. So, you know... And that's and that's the enemy's job to, you know, for these officers to keep doing this and stuff. Because it's that is his demonic spirits, it's his minions that's doing that. But the thing about the but for the video, the ignorance that black people be doing also, the ignorance. When the officer stop you because you're doing something, you you did something, you probably stop you for for stepping as a ticket. 
Simply as a ticket. And now you ready to cuss him out. You ready to get out the car and beat him up because he stopped you for a ticket. Because you were in the wrong for you were probably speeding. So now you ready to cuss him out. You ready to call him all types of names, all types of words. You ready to you ready to get out and just let him have it. Then when he starts saying some stuff back to you, you ready to start recording. Y'all ready to pull your camera out and start recording. Now, like like I said, not all the time though, because I seen some sometimes where I seen some cases where, you know, the officers were doing too much. They were doing entirely too much. For that, you know, doing spraying that man in, in the face with, with the pepper spray. You know, sometimes they be putting their hands on 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 people for no reason. Like, come on now. You know, officers do be in the wrong for doing that. But but then again, you got other you got other people that's that's out here and out here just fighting officers. They fighting them. They literally trying to grab they you know I seen where that man he, he um the officers killed him at that um, restaurant because he he was fighting the officers. He was fighting them. He took the officers' taser out his out off of him and tased the officer. So they probably felt like their life was in danger. But people want to march and do that. People want to march and stuff. Oh, oh, they killed him. Oh, they. So, so, if, so if the man would have pulled his, would have had a gun on him, and drew his gun at the officers, but the officers got him before before they, the officers got him before he got them. So now the officers are in the wrong for that. I don't see where the officers are in the wrong for that. For doing what they got to do before before a, a civilian kills them. They have a family too. Not all officers are bad. Not all of them. Some of them are now. But not all of them. Because like I, like I just said two times already. Because you have black officers acting the same way. This has nothing to do with racism. It's a demonic spirit. And these people... People being so ignorant, you know, Black Lives Matter. But black people, y'all be, you know, y'all, it's it's to the point where I, you know, I used to be working at a place. I used to be working at, at a restaurant and stuff. And they come in there and, and um, you know, hey, hi, hi, do y'all y'all have this? No, we don't have it. What? Y'all got that? What? Being ignorant. Causing the scene, causing the scene for what? Because we ain't got pepper. We ain't got salt. You causing the scene for that? Somebody wearing something crazy. Somebody wearing something weird and crazy in the in Walmart or in the mall or something. Y'all doing that? Y'all y'all want to start acting stupid for that? Somebody somebody just say one little word to you. You ready to start going off? You ready to start acting stupid? Y'all giving them reasons to to talk about us. You're giving them reasons. Out here acting stupid, acting stupid for nothing, giving them making it worse. I mean, they ain't like with everything going on and stuff with Black Lives Matter and stuff, black people, officers killing black people. I would think that you know, you would think that we would start acting more, acting more respectful, you know, getting our getting our act together. But they're so ready to, to shoot somebody and stuff. They walk around here talking about gangs and gangs and gang this, gang that. Gang, I'm doing it for my block, man. I'm doing it for my hood. I'm doing it for this, man. I'm, man, I might as well hit a lick or something. Acting stupid. Ignorant. That is, that's just straight ignorant. But be so ready. But be so ready to to, to go march for something for y'all. Y'all y'all feeling stupidity. And... You know, um, I heard somebody, Lil Baby said in his song, he said, uh, he said, um, I'm gonna stand for my people either, either if we're, we're right or we wrong. I had a problem with, with, um, when he said that, you know, Lil Baby, my favorite rapper, but I had a problem with, when, when he said that, because you gonna stand for your, your people if we right or wrong. So what if your people, what if the person that you standing for Killed the killed the innocent child. 
killed a um an innocent person. So you gonna stand for them if they they killed an innocent person? That's what you gonna do? I'm not standing for them. I get up in that in that courtroom for them and hey, put them in the put them in the hole. Life. Life. You want to be stupid and, and killing innocent people, robbing innocent people, fighting anybody for one? Hey, pay the consequences for it. Bye. See you later. I ain't standing with you for, for ignorance, for, for stupidity. I ain't standing for it. And I ain't marching for nothing. At all. You out here, these dudes, they out here, you know, killing people murdering that same but but when but when when y'all y'all killing each other for your neighborhood you know for your game you know in your neighborhood killing each other y'all ain't marching for that but y'all want to march for when when an officer when a white officer killing killing somebody but you out here killing each other for no reason over a certain color for a shirt over a neighborhood you killing each other for for something stupid as that but we ain't marching for that, though. This Black Lives Matter crap is getting on my nerves. Rest in peace to George Floyd and Breonna Taylor and Trayvon Martin and stuff, because that was some innocent cases. I mean, hey, I wasn't there when they, when they got killed, so I don't know. But from what I heard, it sounded like some, some innocent cases. But hey... Most high probably seen something different from us. You know, it's, I don't know. But the point of the video is black people stop being so ignorant. And then they won't give us, then they won't, we, it won't give them a reason to act like that towards us. If you would treat yourself with some class, some dignity, some, some respect, stop being so ignorant, then maybe they'll start acting more respectful towards us. You know? So, you know, we gotta, gotta get it together, y'all. If you want them to, if you want them to start treating us better, then start, start doing better. Start having a better attitude. Stop being so stupid. It's so, well, not stupid. Stop being so ignorant. But when I say stop being so stupid, stop being so stupid as, you know, so stupid as trying to fight an officer to give him a reason to, to shoot you. I mean, shoot. I mean, hell, hell with it. If, if you don't agree with, you get stopped by them. If you don't agree with what they what they doing, just just go by whatever they they saying and it's gonna be over with. Instead of giving them a hard time, you know. But hey, this is my word, you know. This is what I think. This is my opinion. But that was just my message for today. I'm out, y'all. Peace.